Hey, hey, how's it going? If you're new here, my name is Jan and I love makeup. And if you're not new, thanks for coming back. I really appreciate you. Today's video I'm super excited about. Shawnee and I are collabing again on another video. Our last one was so much fun to do. We thought, let's just do it again. We both picked up the Sydney Grace and the Fancy Face Tropicolor palette, which I've used a few times. Um, neither one of us got this when it was first released. It's a pricier palette, and sometimes you just can't get all the things you want. So this went on sale, and Shawnee texted me and said, uh, did you get this? Because it's on sale, and it's pretty good. And so I went and looked, and she was not wrong. And so I messaged her back and said, yeah, I'm, I'm totally getting it and she got it as well. So we supported each other in this purchase. You know, it's, it's important to have support when there's a sale and you need to pick something up. <laughs> so anyway, we both got the palette and she hadn't used hers yet. So I was like, let's do something. And, and she was all for it because she's amazing. I just love her with my whole heart. And if you aren't already subscribed to her channel, go check her out. I'm going to link her channel below. She's fabulous. You're going to love her. Trust me on sunscreen. Okay, so the point of this video is to do an eyeshadow palette bingo with the Tropicolor palette. Eyeshadow uh, palette bingos are, I think, a lot of fun. It gives you a chance to play with makeups and maybe do something you wouldn't normally do. You know, I think a lot of times we like specific things in eyeshadow application and color stories and that's what we stick to which is totally fine but once in a while it might be fun to step outside that box and just do something super random so we decided on five colors five different shades and i have a let me see if i can just get my phone to open up to the page i have a random number generator I've used this before. So there are 18 shades in this palette. And so I set the max to 18 and we're gonna generate the first color. So we got number three. So I'm gonna just go across the palette one row at a time. Let's see if I can hold it up the right way for you. So shade number three is sun rays. So that will be one. <laughs> we'll generate again. Shade 11. Ooh, okay, this is gonna be interesting. 11 is Wolmers. All right, blue and yellow. The next shade is 17, which is Milk River. It's this kind of orangey brown. All right. So we need two more. We got number eight, which is blue maho. And the last one is, we already got three. Do it again. Shade 12. And that is Negril. That is definitely one of my favorite shades in this palette. So we have sun rays, blue maho, Wolmers, Negril, and Milk River. That is all five shades. So let me swatch these out and see what we can do. I'll be right back. Okay, I swatched them out on my hand. I'm gonna insert a clip right here while I put on my shadow shields. I feel like doing a blue look is something I would normally do anyway. And it seems kind of obvious. So what if I don't use the blue as my primary color? What if I do like the orange and yellow on the inner and middle of my lid, and then I put Negril on the outer, and then I use the blues on my lower lash line and inner corner? I don't know what this is gonna look like, but I think it's gonna be really fun. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take a refer number 02 with the yellow sunray shade, and I'm just going to apply that on the inner portion of my lid. I 
primed my eyes with the MAC Paint Pot in Painterly. I think if I had realized I was going to use yellow, I may have gone with a lighter base. But this is showing up really nicely. I really, really like most of these shades. I'm excited to be playing with this again. And I'm so excited that Shawnee wanted to do another video with me. I just think she is so amazing. As far as human beings go, she seems like a really, really good one. I like her a lot. It's so fun, like making new friends and that's not something I do easy and she's definitely become a friend and that's pretty cool. All right, I mean, that yellow is absolutely gorgeous. If you like a yellow eyeshadow, this is fantastic. So now we're gonna go into Milk River, which is that kind of orangey brown. Same brush, I just wiped it off on my handy dandy little towel. And that's gonna go in here. I will, of course, blend the yellow and the orange together so they don't look weird, but that's pretty cool. That's what I mean about, you know, kind of stepping outside what you would normally do because with those blues, I would happily do a blue look. I love blue eyeshadow. But I wouldn't necessarily have thought, oh, let me put the orangey shade with the yellow shade and then use blue on my lower lash line. So, eyeshadow palette bingos are fun. Sometimes things don't work out like you hope they would, but it's a good time. And I definitely would recommend if you have eyeshadow palettes you're not sure what to do with, and we're going to go in with Negril. Just get a random number generator on your phone and just do something fun and different. I really like this blue eyeshadow so much. I've used it a lot. It's a really nice deepening up shade, which, you know, <laughs> we all know I'm a pretty big fan of. And they blend out so nicely. Just like it a lot. I will be going back over the shades and blend them. I just kind of want to get it mapped out a little bit. I didn't get a single shimmer. And in an 18 pan palette, eight of those shades are shimmers and I didn't get any. I'm not mad about it. I really, really like all matte looks. I really, really like shimmer too. So, all right, let me go back over with Milk River and blend that into the blue. Not too, too much, because we don't want it to get funky. That's pretty cute. I'm gonna clean off my brush again, and we'll go back into Sun Rays and blend that over Milk River. You know what? I don't think that looks bad at all. I'm going to take a clean fluffy brush and just blend over the edges. Okay, I'm going to quickly do the other eye, throw on the rest of my face, and then I'll come back and we'll do the other two blue shades together. Have kids, they said. It'll be fun, they said. And it was. Until they turned 28. <sighs> Boy, howdy. Okay, so I did the rest of my face, obviously. And I'm going to go in with Blue Maho, which is the lighter blue, on the inner portion of my eye. I'm going to try not to get any fallout. That's really, really pretty. Again, not something I would have probably set out to do. I'm not a creative kind of girl, but that's really fun. And then we're gonna take Woolmers on the under eye. 
It does look very similar to Blue Maho, but it's a bit of a deeper tone. I'm going to stop there. And then I'm going to use a little bit of Negril, which is that dark blue on the outer, just to connect the upper and lower together. I'm not mad at this look at all. I'm going to go throw on some uh, baby blue eyeliner, some mascara, and then I'll come back and we can wrap this up. All right, that's the look done and dusted. How about I zoom you in for an up close at the eyes? What do you think? I think it's pretty fun. Again, not something I would typically do, but I like it. I did use my LA Girl Pastel Dream Auto Eyeliner in the shade Powder Blue on my waterline. These LA Girl eyeliners, oh, they're so good really really like them and then uh my blush is the odin's eye peach gleam i thought the orange would be cute with the eye look so my highlighter is jaclyn hill iced really like this highlighter a lot and that's the look i really like this i'm so so excited to see the eyeshadow shades that shawnee got and what she did with them Oh, it's going to be so fun. So after you watch my video, go check out Shawnee's or go check out Shawnee's and come back and watch mine. Either way, I super appreciate you hanging out with us. Let me know in the comment section what you think of eyeshadow palette bingos. Should I make it a regular thing on my channel? Because uh, I'm not mad at this and I had a lot of fun. It was interesting to try and figure out how to make the shades work, but I think I did okay. All right, enough yammering. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Either way, I appreciate you hanging out with me. Be good and remember to be kind to you.